Hey beauties, welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, it's gonna be a collaboration video with another YouTuber. Her name is Zuri FX here on YouTube. I'll leave all her stuff down below so you guys can check out her video and her channel and all that good stuff. So we decided to go ahead and recreate a look from each other. So she does special effects, so I decided to do a look from one of the looks that she created recently and she took one of my beauty looks to recreate on her channel so what you guys are gonna see here that I'm doing I'm just doing one of the eyes a very simple natural look and I'm using a Sigma palette I'll leave everything down below that I use um, in the description section for you guys so that's what I'm pretty much doing here just a very simple eye look um, just a quick you know little recap not a recap but um, quick reminder <laughs> I lost my train of thought for a second if you're not already subscribed please hit that subscribe button it will mean the world to me and if you like videos like this where I'm doing collaboration videos or even special effects make sure you give this video a big thumbs up you guys all right please do that for me and follow me on all of my other social media platforms as well so right here I'm using the Meron um, liquid latex and what I did was I just placed them down now you guys are gonna see the first method that I tried wasn't really filling it um, only reason was because I couldn't really blend the edges well with the latex that I had. So you guys are gonna see I you know I put the cotton pad down. I'm trying to add some liquid latex to the edges and it just really wasn't working for me. I tried to do her method. Um, she did use scar wax in her video, but yeah, I was not trying to mess with scar wax. I actually really hate scar wax. Um, I'm not great at using it, so I didn't want to use it. I just kind of wanted to stick with something very, very really simple. But you guys are going to see soon, I do take this off, and I end up using cotton balls instead. Just, you know, ripping out little strips, placing them where I need to place it, and then adding the latex um, to blend out the edges and also saturate it to make it have, like, a weird... So that's what you guys are going to see here. Alright guys, so as I continue to build the, um, the height of how I want it, I am pulling the edges. Um, so you guys see here and I'm actually pulling because you want to make it look like you have a ripped out eyeball pretty much like you know something gouged your eye out so you want to have that um, somewhat of raised pulled effect effect on the body so that's what I did and right now I am Filling in my eye with a black cream paint. Now the cream paints that I'm using I actually got at Spirit Halloween. Um, it's like a stack you use to like make bruises and stuff like that. So that's what I'm using, and I'm doing that um, while the latex latex dries. And I'm just using different colors, you know, black, really um, dark maroon, some red. Then I do go in with the blood. So I go in with my scab blood, put it all in the inside of my eye, um, some on the outside and everything like that. You guys are going to see, I, I literally just, you know, do all of that. So 
so yeah I did forgot to say um, I forgot to say that I um, put my foundation over the latex once it was dried and then I put the scab look which is what I'm doing right now one thing I definitely say and you know working with special effects products scab blood makes everything look a lot more gory you guys like it literally really does like look at that it just like oh just the chunk of blood and it just makes everything look so nasty and then i do take some fake blood this one's more of a, a syrup texture and i put you know some on the outside as you guys see there um, I think I lost some of that footage, so that's why you guys didn't see. I think um, my camera had cut off. So right now I'm just taking my Maron Paradise Paint, um, taking the red, and I took um, this little fan brush and I just started splattering it all over um, just to make it look a lot more nasty and bloody. And then that's it. I put a red lip and then you guys see the final result. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure you guys check out my girl Zuri's video. Um, she actually chose a very, very beautiful, beautiful um, beauty look that I did that includes body painting. So yes, definitely go ahead and check out her look. I know she killed it. So yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye.